So I figured out the return value. Um, what it is is it returns whatever ob object or value, uh, you know, whatever variable is sent to it, it returns it back to its original state if the save function on B menu or the returnable, um, which is returnable, um, it returns the, the value of this variable back to what it was if this save function is not called. So refs menu 2 save, so this is my ref menu 2. If I call the save function, um, it updates it and so it gets the new value, but if I don't call the save function, it returns it back to the original state. So I'll show you that in, uh, in here. So um, I have to make it read, I have to take it rid of the read only so I can give it a bad value. So I'll give it a good value, that's fine, that updated, that called save, and that's why it changed. Now if I give it a bad value, save, nothing updates here, so this is never called, this save is never called. So when I click off of it, the return value is going to assign the last update to itself, which was the correct value, 04. Um, it's going to return it back to that value. So um, we can see that in the code. Um, here's the menu, which imports the returnable mixin, which has the return value prop. I don't understand how return value becomes camel case return value, but that must be some behind the scenes magic somewhere. So this is where we pass in that date. Um, so we're passing in that date variable to this return value. So this becomes, this return value becomes date. So when there's a watcher on the is active of the menu, and when is active is true, that means V menu is now shown. So the value um, is true, which means, this is, means it's being shown. And so return value, which is the date object that we passed in, that gets assigned to the original value when the menu first comes up. So that is right here. So we've got a value here. When I click to open up this, this made the menu show up, which made, which um, is active became true. So it called this function here, return value was that good date. It was this date is the return value and uh, it gets assigned to return value. So if I now change it, but click off so that save is not called, um, the is active is now false, which runs this side. So it updates return value to the original value which we set when we opened up, which was the original date object. So that's why it didn't get changed. But if we do a valid date where I go like this and I watch this, this will change. So that means the input changed, which means the save did get called. So the new date is now saved. So um, on true, it was the original, it was the, the original date, the 04, I think it was. And then um, I changed it to a five, which called this save function, which um, had the, the value of the new date, which comes from here. So we call that save function with the value of the date that is currently um, on the input. That's when this changed, that called it and, and sent the valid date because it was happy. And so, the original value becomes the new value and then asset active is set to false to close the menu so the watcher sees uh, and updates the return value to the original value which is the value that was just set here so um, hopefully you can kind of see that it's um, you know it's, it's holding the the original value unless save is called unless this save function is called. If this save function is not called, in fact, if I take out, um, I bet if I take out 
I might just take this out. Granted, this is going to update over here, so I won't have a date, but I shouldn't be able to save the the date goes back to nothing because I didn't call that save function. So it just goes back to the original date, which was nothing. Um, if I put that back, um, now yeah, obviously it works again because that update gets called. Um, the other thing is, is this makes no sense without the dot sync because the mixin has to, you know, emit a return value to it. So without the dot sync, it, it can't, it can't update date. So um, this this return value thing makes no sense. Um, and I'm not sure exactly what what, ha what happened. I was playing with it a while ago, but um, I think if I um, when I click off of it now, it doesn't work because it can't update back to that old because of the mix and you know um, emitter can't pass that value back up to this to this return value to change date back to what it was before. So um, that's pretty much what it is. It's a st it holds a previous state unless the save function is called. Um, it'll revert whatever this variable is back to what it was when the menu was first opened.